Hey guys, Jeff here. Just want to talk through my cook kit. Um, this is what I bring on day hikes. This is what I'm going to bring on my multi-day hike to St. Cuthbert's this coming up summer. Um, it'll have a bit more on that in the summer, but um, just want to unpack that and show you guys what I typically bring with me when I go out for the day. Okay, so here we go. We have a Thermarest stuff sack. Uh, for a Thermarest I don't use anymore. I find that it holds my kettle. It's just right. See the um, circumference of it's just right. So um, it's not a waterproof dry sack, but it works. So to start, we've got some sugar. I got these little pots at Morrison's. They cost, they were like four for a pound 50 or something. They're salad dressing pots, but they hold all my little bits and bobs that I need for tea and coffee just right. Um, I have enough supplies in here for two people to have tea, coffee, sugar, and creamer uh, for about two cups apiece. Um, so these are my favorite cups. This is a Wildo Folda cup. They're some kind of plastic um, PTE maybe. I can't remember what it's called. Um, they fold up when you're done with them and when you tip them over because it's got this lip water or coffee or whatever it doesn't come out so you can put it in your pocket when you're done and not have to worry about spilling on yourself so I carry two of those um, I like an old-fashioned spoon um, this is stainless steel I do have a spork I've got Yuko gear um, spork knife fork combo thingy but I much prefer this when I'm just out for the day making tea or coffee got this for Christmas this is the Trandia triangle um, guy I follow on YouTube Wiltshire man has one uh, so I thought I'd give it a go so you um, put it together like so it can be a bit fiddly But once you got it together, it's quite small, got wind holes, um, forgot to mention it is for the Trangia Spirit Burner. So um, I went ahead and got the Trangia Kettle to go with it, holds I think 900 mil, fits right on top, just right. Uh, and then in here I keep my tea bags. Instant coffee and coffee mate. Um, I've written it can hold about six cups each in these little containers and they nest together, which is pretty cool. And then finally, I've got my my um, Trangia burner, which sits down in there like so. I have um, a jet boil, I have a pocket rocket, um, I like them, they get water boiled quickly, but this is quiet. Makes almost no noise at all. Um, so when you're in the woods and you're having a nice quiet time, it really does help. Forgot to mention the um, kettle by Trangia. Um, really like it. Uh, it's really lightweight, made of aluminum. Easy to um, clean, you get your whole hand in there. Also acts as a storage container. Um, I really like the easy pour spout here. Um, no drips to worry about. You know, with your pocket rocket kit, you have to pour from the lip, which can be a bit dangerous when you're working with boiling water. So I like it. It's solid because it's got quite a lot, uh, wide base on it, um, so it doesn't slip at all once it's on here. Um, so. so yeah, that's um, my cook kit. This is what I bring with me. If I'm gonna go on a more long distance hike, I might replace my spoon with a spork um, or a combination like my Yuko gear um, spork fork knife combo thingy, just cause I can get more done with it. And I, obviously I would lose, lose a cup and add in the 600 mil version. Um, but yeah, this is ultra light. I, if I put fuel in here and carry all of this, I mean, maybe it's not ultralight. It weighs about 700 grams, but 
it gets the job done and I'm not worried about the weight. So thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoy it. Let me know what you think.